Hey guys, my name is Elena, I'm a graphic designer and welcome to my graphic design channel and today I'm going to show you how to draw that snowflake in Adobe Illustrator and if you're interested, please keep watching. But at first I want to invite you to my Telegram channel where you will find a huge chat where you can talk with each other and sometimes with me uh, and as well where you will find uh, all information about my YouTube tutorials and as well now I have Black Friday on my course Commercial Portfolio Step Up. If you're interested you can go to my course website on my course, you will create your first commercial portfolio and will understand how to make money with your portfolio. And if you're interested, please come to my course, learn and after make money with your portfolio. And now let's start to draw our snowflake in Adobe Illustrator. This is size of my workspace and these are colors which I'm going to use in my tutorial and if you want to take a closer look at the design and to download an original vector file with colors from my design, you can do it on my Patreon page, the link will be below this tutorial. And now let's start to draw a snowflake. My workspace is ready and colors are already in the swatches panel. Uh, let's take for now any color, let it be white color and rectangle tool and let's create background. Okay, now let's take liner gradient, here that color and here this one. Okay, now let's take white color and pen tool hold shift and create straight line okay now let's take that brush for the line and the size 0 0.5 now pen tool And create the first line, now the second line. And the last one. Okay, now let's move a little those lines. Select all. That brush and 1.5. Okay, now let's fix a little those lines, direct section tool, select that point and make the line shorter. The same here. And here. Okay, like this. Now select all three lines, transform, reflect, vertical copy and move the copies here. Okay, now select the whole shape. Object Expand Appearance, Pathfinder Unite. Now Transform, Reflect, Horizontal, Copy and move down. Ok. Select both. Transform, Rotate. Uh, 45, no better, 60 degrees, copy and Ctrl D. 
Okay, it's ready. Now again pen tool and create here the first line and the second. Fill to stroke that brush 1.5 Okay, and now copy that shape, hold odd and make copy and just rotate and make that shape. Just rotate and make it like that. Okay, it's ready, select. Uh, let's make it a little fatter, that snowflake, but at first go to Object, Expand Appearance and um, Pathfinder Unite. And now let's select the snowflake, make it a little smaller like that and let's add stroke here. Let's try this one uh -huh. and this one, no, it's too much, let's take that one. Ok, it's ready, select and uh, go to Object Expand Appearance, Pathfinder Unite. Ok, the snowflake is ready, now let's make paper effect. Let's create rectangle like that. Ok, now select both shapes, um, like this, hold ALT, make copy, ok, and here Pathfinder intersect and the same here Pathfinder, select both shapes, Pathfinder intersect. Move the shape here. Okay, it's ready. And now a line. Okay, now let's add gradient here, line or gradient. That color here and that one in that place. Okay, uh, again liner gradient, here th this color and that one here, it's ready, let's play with slider. Copy and paste shape and squeeze it a little here, um, but at first let's add gradient, let's select this shape and again liner gradient with these colors. colors. Now uh, select this shape, effect, uh, style, uh, drop shadow, these options and here I have that color code. Ok. OK, and move that part here, object, 
uh, style and drop shadow the same okay okay guys our snowflake is ready uh, now let's add here white line with pen tool or with uh, line tool now let's select it in background and send to back okay it's ready now select the whole snowflake make it smaller put here okay and now let's create composition with snowflakes now i'm going to uh, copy and paste that snowflake and um, make it smaller bigger I'm going to make uh, the white line longer or shorter. It uh, depends of uh, place of snowflake. Let's make that line longer with help of direct selection tool like that. And now let's make composition with that snowflake. Let's group it. And now hold out, make copies and make something like this okay you can create your own composition uh, let's create two small snowflakes with ellipse tool here one bigger one smaller select uh, now go to symbols plus okay select symbols plus okay now delete these two ellipses and they take one symbol uh symbol spray tool symbol sprayer tool and spray it now the next and spray okay the snow is ready and here soft light opacity soft light okay it's ready and now let's create uh, the light let's take ellipse tool create the ellipse now we need to take radial gradient orange color here black color here and let's move the slider like that okay now let's uh, make copy squeeze that one put here uh, now make it a little longer squeeze a little and now uh, opacity screen and now let's copy rotate put here Transform reflect vertical copy like that. Now move in that place. Okay, it's okay, it's ready now. <clears throat> let's uh, rotate this line. Uh, here opacity as well uh, screen put here uh, okay now we need to add more light in the center let's make copy and squeeze that ellipse make it smaller rotate put here okay make copy rotate i need more light in the center okay and now let's copy one more time squeeze like that make smaller and put here 
monkey copy and paste one big ellipse and put here okay <clears throat> and now uh, we need to copy um, the middle the middle line that one uh, and uh, let's rotate it 90 degrees copy like that okay let's make these lines smaller and move that here yes now i like that star select the light and select other objects group it and let's put the light in the places you like just copy it and make composition copy and paste background bring it to front select the whole composition and make clipping mask well guys that's all for today hope you like my tutorial if yes give me a like and subscribe and see you in the next tutorials in adobe illustrator or in the next videos about the graphic design bye bye guys bye